Hey there, how's it going? Well, there's something I should have mentioned in my last video, but didn't. I guess I figured that enough people were talking about it that I didn't need to talk about it too, but it would have made my video make more sense. If things turn to shit for social commentators on YouTube, it's not going to turn to shit for all social commentators. If you're putting out stuff that kind of lines up with MTV Decoded and CBC News and ContraPoints and a whole number of others that have been propped up on this platform, um, yeah, you won't have a problem. But if you have wrong think, and you differ from those things, yeah, that you're probably going to have a problem. Um, it's no longer going to be a message of, oh, well, uh, you're, you're pushing an alt-right message. It's, they'll be saying things like, oh, well, what you're saying could be a gateway to the alt-right. Oh, a gateway to it, right? That's the kind of thinking that's going to go on. Doesn't matter if it's not alt-right at all, but, oh, it's a gateway to the alt-right. Oh, it's a gateway to fascism. You question, you question these things over here. It's a gateway to fascism. Oh, okay. You know, those are the kinds of videos that are going to be removed from, from YouTube. Those are the kinds of things that will eventually get people's channels taken down. And it's those types of things that I'll probably end up removing from my channel so I don't get my channel taken down. Key phrase, if things turn to shit. They may not. And if they don't, and we can continue making as much social commentary as we want without that kind of worry, then cool. But who knows?